We're in Boston in a building where many great champions have been crowned. And right now, the tag team titles are on the line. The champions, Kofi Kingston and our truth against the unlikely team of Daniel Bryan and Kane. Well, talk about an odd couple, Michael. With everything we've seen from Bryan and Kane in the past few weeks, I gotta wonder if Dr. Shelby's anger management therapy can turn these two into a cohesive unit. What do you know about therapists, Saxton? They've been thrusted into this position while the champions have been centered around their teamwork for the past five months. Kane and Bryan only have anger management in common. I wouldn't call that a building block towards tag team titles. Great move! You know, Byron Kane and Daniel Bryan almost accidentally stumbled into this title opportunity when they defeated the prime-time players on last week's Raw. I can tell you it was no accident when Kane delivered a hateful choke slam on Bryan. It just so happened that Daniel landed on their opponent long enough to gain the pinfall. I can't foresee that being the outcome against the champions, though. Nobody takes to the skies quite like him. Oh, man, so painful. That landed perfectly. Up and over. Hammerlock applied. Oh, no, no. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, it's going to break their arm. Oh, oh man. Gosh, why? You know, I have to say, I have seen some progress in Kane and Daniel Bryan's anger management. I don't think they are all the way there, but there's been definite progress. I see it too, Michael. We don't see Daniel screaming in the face of fans anymore. He's keeping his composure pretty well. And Kane? Well, Kane is still Kane. There is some deep-rooted trouble within that monster. Boom! What a right! Kane making a statement as we speak. In comparing Daniel Bryan and Kane's progress in therapy, I think there are two different cases. Brian had an emotional breakdown brought on by the WWE Universe, whereas Kane has just been sick and demented since birth. Well, one of those things for sure, they're both off the rocker in my estimation. Great job, Dr. Cole. That'll change his posture in a hurry. I think I hear R-Truth calling. He's got the shoulders down. Oh, boy, he is. And the fight must go on. Gotta take more than that. So, Michael, let me ask you, did Daniel Bryan's anger management issues begin way back in April at WrestleMania, when Bryan, who was World Heavyweight Champion at the time, lost his title to Sheamus in a record 18 seconds? It's been haunting Daniel Bryan for months. Yes, it did. Listen, Daniel Bryan confessed that WrestleMania was the most embarrassing moment of his whole life, and that's including the time his fiance left him at the altar. Come to think of it, that was this year, too. I can't blame Daniel for feeling some stress. Flashing with a clothesline. And our truth evades that one. And our truth evades that one. Takes him down in a major way, too. Uh-oh. He's a spinning ball of energy. I need to say, guys, if Daniel Bryan and Kane can work together and win here tonight. Dr. Shelby deserves a Nobel Peace Prize. Well, I hate to burst your bubble, Cole, but I have it on good authority that Dr. Shelby isn't even a certified therapist. My sources on the health board say he dropped out of medical school to visit Tibet on some kind of spiritual excursion. The guy's a fraud. Kane has held 11 tag team titles in his career. Yeah, there's a chance for 12, but Daniel Bryan's going to have to help. Kane with the excellent move to get out. Oh, that did not look good for our truth Going for something else, it seems. I suspect he knows something that we don't, Cole. Why else would he just let him out of that hole? Can we address our truth and little Jimmy, please? 
If anyone needs Dr. Shelby, it's our truth. The guy's seeing things. He's holding ropes to let an imaginary person into the ring. Forget Daniel Bryan and Kane. Someone please help our truth. I think our truth is doing just fine. This week, WWE.com had a pictorial about Little Jimmy's family. Portraits like Little Jimmy in a birthday party hat. Pretty fabulous. Cole, I was reaching out to get our truth help for his imaginary delusion, but you're here enabling self-destructive behavior. We know what having imaginary friends well into adulthood can do to a person. We've seen what it's done to Saxon. Well, uh, I would have to refute that, okay? I'm a well-adjusted adult gentleman with many real-world friends, too. <laughs> Thank you very much. I've been seeing Daniel and Kane in therapy for weeks now. It's not anger management that these two need. What they need is respect from the WWE Universe. These Yes Chance fans do. Here comes Daniel Bryan sending Kingston across the ring. And Daniel Bryan looking to put Kobe Kingston away for the tag team titles. Ooh, Kingston's in trouble. The Kane are in Whoa. peril. Wait. The big red machine making the long climb to the top rope. Why do you think Bryan uh, wanted Kane to make the tag? No, not at all. He felt like he was in control. And now Kane is heading up top. It's just a matter of time until this team implodes. We know they can't stand each other. Kobe Kingston. Look at Bryan. Bryan is hanging on to the ankle of Kane. Kingston. Crash and burn. And now Daniel Bryan. Shoved away oh, by Kane. This is hilarious. Bryan with a shot to Kane. And that's Kane on the top rope. Splash into a cover. New tag team champions. Oh my God. No way. Yes way. No way. I cannot believe and what we new. just saw. What we just saw is two tag men team and champions. And Daniel Bryan. Daniel Bryan. Who can't stand each and other. Kane. But now they're tag team champions. They can't believe it. Daniel Bryan is is celebrating. No amount of therapy could have prepared the WWE Universe for this. This is gonna be a disaster. Can you imagine Kane and Daniel Bryan as tag team champions? You don't have to imagine it, it's a reality. And it's weird. I guess anger management worked, oh, it will at least somewhat, right? Team champions! Oh! Team champions! I am the tag and look at this. Can't even agree who the real champion is. Well, the the them, tag Brian. team champions! I am the tag team champions! Yeah, this is going to be interesting to watch. The There's the obviously no argument here. They both won the titles. They can't even enjoy the victory together. Big Red Machine certainly not pleased with the situation, but he can call himself one half of the tag team champions. 